across Arizona and the nation. While the pandemic continues, there's a glimmer of hope this morning. The first vaccine is expected to be approved by the FDA this week, meaning a vaccine is on its way. And we have a ton of questions. Yeah, that's why we brought in Dr. Frank Lavecchia with Valley Wise Health Medical Center this morning. All right, doctor, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. So Dr. Maricopa County is prepped to get 40,000 doses of the Pfizer vaccine following FDA approval. We learned earlier this week that those will be given out in phases, but the first phase is actually four phases in one, we're told. Can you explain that? Yeah, fortunately, uh, we are part of the first phase, we being healthcare providers. But even in that, we have four small phases. Those who have lots of contact with patients with COVID-19, and that's described as greater than 15 minutes in 24 hours. So most of the people in the emergency department surpass that. Most of the respiratory techs surpass that. And then it goes down to those who have less than 15 minutes. Then it goes down to people who work in facilities that maybe have COVID contact, but not necessarily. Like you might say, we want you to check negative for it. And then finally, you know, places like urgent cares and then all healthcare providers. So um, it is coming. December 17th is what we hear is our start date, but it is even going to be rationed a little bit among us healthcare providers. So, doctor, when do you expect the vaccine to be widely available here in Arizona? So if I wanted to get the vaccine, when do you think that would be possible for someone just to show up somewhere and be able to get one? Even for us, logistically, it's going to be tough. First, the FDA has not approved it yet, which we expect they will approve, approve it later this week. And then we're going to be scheduled for like December uh, 17th or so. We're going to have to make appointments probably at the fairgrounds or three or four other locations. So for the general public, if you have minimal exposure, it's probably going to be at least three months or so till you get your first vaccination. We hope that most of us, most Arizonians, will have the opportunity to have been vaccinated by the summer. And Governor Ducey is saying that the vaccine is going to be free. So how do you think that's going to work? You know, as they say, you know, nothing's really free and uh, it's being paid for by this coronavirus care act where they're giving us relief for that. So everyone's going to be able to get the first vaccine for free after it becomes FDA approved. Then there's a society, the CDC uh, immunization society that looks at it and says, OK, this is OK. You can give this vaccine and then insurance companies have to approve it. They have 15 days after that. So initially it's going to be free then insurance companies are going to be kind of forced, for lack of a better word, yeah. to, you know, pay for it. Yeah, that should be interesting. All right, Dr. Lavecchio, we appreciate it. Stand by. Dr. Lavecchio is going to be with us throughout the morning. Be sure to text your questions. 602-444-1212. We're going to get to as many as we can.